What's good YouTube? This is uh, from Brazil with Love and I'm here with a quick tip um, for any collector out there who wants to display their figures in the box but has these really crappy annoying price tags on them. Here's what you do. Uh, this one was fairly easy. I just pulled it off. But sometimes you pull it off and, you know, they get stuck and it's really gunky and ugly looking. Um, this one I peeled off. As you can see, it left this, um, like, gooey uh, residue. Tip to get this stuff off. Well, first you need a Q-tip, okay? And you're going to need this stuff called Goo Gone. Uh, this stuff is awesome. It's remove stickers, grease gum, tar, uh, crayon, and tape. So what I did is I just, you know, put the, this Q-tip on the tip of it, squeeze a little off, and then what you do is you just rub it off. Just slowly start rubbing it off. Um, it's not going to come all off at once, but it is slowly, as you can see, it's freaking gone. It's gone now. And that's pretty much all it took. Then you just wipe off the extra extra uh, liquid or whatever that's on there and it's gone. Um, you have to be careful though when you're doing this. Like this sticker actually was kind of on this sticker. You know, not to get it on here. Because it will peel that st The sticker will start. That actual sticker will start peeling off. Um, so, a lot of times though, like let's say you wanted to get this sticker off. Well, yeah, that's possible also. Um, I'm going to use a regular Q-tip because I don't want to damage the sticker. But what you would do is you would dip this and then you would start just tapping into it, tapping into it. And eventually it's going to, um, the glue that's behind here will start giving way and then it will start peeling up and then you can just go shh. And then the excess glue there you could just rub off. So. Just a quick tip um, for display purposes, get Goo Gone, it's awesome, it'll get uh, any like, you know, check it out, uh, citrus power and scientific technology combined to defeat the toughest stains, uh, soap scum, scuff marks, you know, whatever, it's good stuff to have if you're a customizer, if you're just a guy who doesn't, who wants to keep his box clean for display and there it is I mean it's back to normal perfect condition I did that with uh, a couple of other figures and it worked so get Google on peace